United Nations Secretary General Ban Ki moon flew into Myanmar on Thursday. Traveling through the Irrawaddy Delta, he saw fields flooded, crops destroyed, and homes and lives shattered. He talked to families who have lost everything and promised that the UN and the international community would do everything possible to help. Mr. Ban said he was encouraged by the relief system already in place, but that rapid reinforcement was needed. He said Myanmar's military government had agreed to allow more international aid workers. It had also said yes to a logistic system which will distribute help more quickly. UNICEF has welcomed the news that more life-saving supplies and support will reach the children of Myanmar, where deadly disease, unsanitary conditions and lack of shelter threaten their lives. It will also mean children's emotional well-being will receive extra attention. The emergencies cause disruption and chaos. And a lot of the children have, been, have seen their parents, uh, their houses broken, uh, their, um, their possessions damaged, their parents lost, their relatives uh, washed away. So it's a, it's a lot of trauma and, um, that they're going through at the moment. Despite their great losses, Myanmar people have begun to rebuild their lives. And Mr. Ban said he was humbled by their courage and resilience. The work of UNICEF and its partners will continue to focus on making sure families' lives return to normal as quickly as possible. This is Chris Niles reporting for UNICEF Television. Unite for Children.